Today we're going to discuss how a 39-year-old female police detective by the name of Alfreda Fluker decided to take the life of a mother of three by the name of Kenesha Fuller, 43 years of age. On the night of April 10, 2020, approximately 11.15 near Germania Park in Birmingham, Alabama, Kenesha Fuller was found dead after being shot in the head while accompanied by Fluker's co-worker, Detective Mario White in an unmarked police car. The victim, Ms. Fuller, was later pronounced dead at a UAMB hospital trauma center. It is important to also note that nobody called in to report this crime. The only way Birmingham Police Department were made aware of this was because BPD has an electronic system in place to detect and report gunshots. Such is something in the picture that is provided below. Detective Mario White was unharmed. It has been rumored that Fluker Fuller and Detective White were involved in a love triangle that ultimately ended bad. In the early morning of Saturday, April 11, 2020, Alfredo Fluker was picked up at her residence and taken into custody. She is being charged with capital murder of Kenesha Fuller and attempted murder of her co-worker Mario White. It has been said that both of the ladies were involved with the detective and that Miss Fluker was jealous and enraged at catching them together and ended Fuller's life. The report states that Detective Mario White is not involved in the murder of Kenesha Fuller. The images that will be in showing are some images that were pulled from Alfred Fluker's Facebook. I provided them here to give you an insight on what was going on on her social media. I also inserted a post from a person who knew Alfredo Fluker. I'll give you a moment to read. Now, I cannot confirm whether these images pertain to the individuals involved here, so take this as you may, ladies and gentlemen. Ms. Alfredo Fluker's next court hearing date is June 25th. Um, I will update you guys as this case proceeds. I will keep the Fuller's family in my prayers, and I hope that justice will be served. And for my sisters and melanin squad, stay tuned for other training stories. Peace out.